A former private school captain and his father faced the Adelaide Magistrates Court on Tuesday, charged with the murder of an Australian father of two. 19-year-old Marco Anthony and 46-year-old Keith Russell Yandel have been accused of shooting Steve Murphy, who they suspected was an intruder on their property. Liberal frontbencher and Shadow Attorney General Julian Lisa has quit the coalition's cabinet in response to Peter Dutton's announcement that the Liberals would not support the voiced parliament referendum. Lisa has been a long-time advocate for a constitutionally enshrined voiced parliament and as a backbencher he can now freely campaign for the referendum. Dozens of classified Pentagon documents have been circulating the internet after a major intelligence leak. The top secret US documents mostly relate to Russia's war against Ukraine, but also include sensitive information about South Korea, Canada, China, Israel and the Middle East. Official investigations into how the leak began are ongoing. One of Australia's most renowned artists, John Olsen, has died at the age of 95. The Newcastle-born painter won the Archibald Prize in 2005 and received an Order of Australia in 2001. Olsen died on Tuesday, surrounded by family.